Still Life with Iris, a fantastical adventure which centers on a little girl's search for the simplest of things, home, is the first play for young audiences to receive the Kennedy Center's Fund for New American Plays Award. See the Highlander Theatre Company stage this production at the Somerville High School Auditorium on Friday, February 7th at 7 p.m. The next day, they're going to be staging it at the Massachusetts Thespians Festival. Suggested admission is $10 on a rolling basis, and tickets can be found at highlandertheater.org. Wednesday, February 12th, head to Aeronaut Brewery for the February Bike Talk Social Hour featuring Jeff Gang as he talks about his year of biking in paradise, aka Holland. Come hang out with fellow bike advocates and other awesome bike-minded people. At 6 p.m., mix and mingle. Then the presentation starts at 6.30 p.m. and runs for one hour with a Q&A to follow. Afterwards, stay and enjoy brews and music. To learn more about this talk and the Bike Talk series, visit SomervilleBikes.org. Founded in 2010, Hero for Hire Creative is an Emmy-nominated Emmy animation studio right here in the Boston area. For 10 years, Hero's many talented artists have been keeping busy with projects for local favorites like the Red Sox and New Balance, as well as national brands like Nickelodeon, DC, and Sesame Street. On Thursday, February 13th, Arts at the Armory welcomes a panel of current Hero for Hire team members to talk about the day-to-day -day of running an animation studio, working with clients big and small, and how to succeed and be creative in a collaborative studio environment. Doors open at 7 p.m. and the talk starts at 7.30. It's free and open to all with a suggested donation of $5. High Energy Vintage and the Green Witch are back with the Love Buzz Sip and Shop Market on Sunday, February 9th from 10.30 to 4.30 at Once Somerville. This Sip and Shop event features more than 30 local vendors with vintage records, handmade goods, and art. This time around, they're adding some exciting extras like a taco bar, tarot readers, a photo booth, caricatures, and more. So grab your valentine, your buds, or just your hat, and pop in to grab a tasty featured cocktail or mocktail, shop for something special, and see what you could get into with them at the Love Buzz Market. Attend the Black History Month celebration on Wednesday, February 12th from 6.30 to 9 at the Arts at the Armory. There you can enjoy an open mic, including a spoken word feature from D. Ruff and DJ Obens. There will be a discussion about mental health and healing in the black community. Food will be provided at this all-ages event presented by Books of Hope, Teen Empowerment, Arts at the Armory, the Somerville Arts Council, and the Massachusetts Cultural Council. Join the East Library Branch and East Somerville Main Streets for the second East Eats program on February 13th at 6.30. This month, enjoy food delights from Vasika, the iconic East Somerville Ethiopian restaurant. This event is a collaboration of, uh, between East Somerville Main Streets, local businesses, and the Somerville Public Library. Free and everyone is welcome. Come hear stories from Mr. B and taste some delicious food. And more information is at eastsomervillemainstreets.org. Join the Somerville Public Library at Remnant Brewing for a talk with Lindsay Allen, the rooftop farm manager at Boston Medical Center, on Wednesday, February 5th from 7 to 9. In uncertain times, it is often helpful to look to the past to better inform our futures. And this talk will feature, will focus on the history of urban agriculture and how that has shaped our city's current food systems. Attendees will learn about the history of urban gardening, food justice, rooftop farming, and innovative ways to grow food at your home, including tips for your home garden. More information is at SomervillePublicLibrary.org. February 7th through 17th, attend the 45th Boston Sci-Fi Film Festival, which is an 11-day cinematic event held at the historic Somerville Theater. And this year, Somerville Media Center is a media sponsor of Boston Sci-Fi. The first nine days consist of a traditional film festival, whether they be features, shorts, webisodes, workshops, parties, or a new Hollywood film. Boston Sci-Fi emphasizes emerging directors with distinct visions from around the globe. The festival then concludes with the original Binge View, the marathon, which is a 24-hour motion picture endurance test. So imagine 750 close friends sitting in a vintage movie theater, straining your eyeballs and tush muscles, watching everything from classics, soon-to-be classics, and the occasional schlock disaster. Info, including screening times, workshop times, special events, and more is at bostonsci-fi.com. 
On February 8th, join the ladies of Kamikaze and Kamikaze at the 8-Bit Bead Art Fundraiser for Ladies Con. The ladies' first event of the year is a fun craft night using perler beads at Kamikaze in Davis Square. Create something from pop culture or just something you think will look awesome. Then turn it into a magnet, a pin, a keychain, or whatever you want. The cost of the event is $10, and all of it is going towards keeping admission to LadiesCon free. More information is at kamikaze.com. Mix up a self-love potion this Valentine's Day with the Boston Women's Market on February 13th at Warehouse 11 in Somerville at 6 p.m. Grab your BFF and go for an evening of self and community uh, as you meet women makers, entrepreneurs, and artists. All are welcome to this family-friendly indoor event. Pups of the human and dog variety are also welcome. And more information is at bostonwomensmarket.com. A similar but different but similar event can be found starting an hour later at 1 Somerville. Galentine's Day has transcended the television screen and become established in everyday culture. On February 13th, Galentine's Day, a non-official holiday, is celebrated as a day for ladies celebrating ladies. Join Hear Me Roar artists on Thursday, February 13th at 7 p.m. at 1 Somerville as they create Galentine's Day with locally owned vendors that have jewelry, clothing, candles, treats, sexy things, and self-care goodies. They'll have food, dancing, tarot readers, a photo booth, and local craft tastings as well. Attend the Armory Pub Sing on February 13th. Based on a traditional English pub sing, but with a bit of an American flavor, this group meets twice a month on each second Thursday and fourth Tuesday. It's open to all and is hosted by the Greater Boston Traditional Song. Pub singing emphasizes spontaneity, rich harmonies, and energetic joy, but most of all it emphasizes group participation. Sing the fine old drinking songs, sea chanties, and chorus songs from the British Isles and New England. Pretty much anything goes as long as it encourages group singing and everybody to participate. Bring a song to share or just join in on the choruses. Start time for the event is 7 p.m., but many arrive early to have dinner. Uh, at the cafe where there's soup, sandwiches, and desserts, as well as wine, cider, and a nice variety of bottles and cans so you can clap your hands and clap your hands, yeah. Visit Arts at the Armory for details. Music Industry Boston hosts, hosts a Black History Artist Showcase on Tuesday, February 18th at 7.30 p.m. at the Jungle Community Music Club in Union Square. Join them as they celebrate Black History Month with diverse voices of their artistic community. This event will be free and 21 plus and features performances by Kayla Johnson, Ashley Friedman, Dominic Hippolyte, Love Emerald, and Stax Montana. And more information is at junglemusicclub.com. Books and Brews is a social book club for readers in their 20s and 30s and the young at heart, and they meet every third Tuesday to discuss a new book. So mark your calendar for February 18th at 6.15 at Aeronaut Brewing to get excited to chat. Copies of the February book will be available at all three Somerville Public Library locations. Stop by the circulation desk, give them the password, which is uh, just basically say that you're a Books and Brews member. Uh, and more information is at Somerville Public Library Org. The 27th annual Mardi Gras Ball is a benefit for Girls Rock Camp and fed, features the legendary Voodoo Crew Band. Special guests this year include Jen Dangora, Andrea Gillis, Erica Mantone, and a cast of thousands. And it's happening February 21st at 7.30 at once. And more information is at the Facebook event page. Head to the Somerville Theater on Friday, February 28th at 8 p.m. to see the 1971 film Socrates, presented by Channel Zero. Western civilization's first free speech case it happened when the famed philosopher was put on trial in Athens for impiety and misleading youth. Has a matter of philosophy become a capital offense? Directed by Italian neorealist pioneer Roberto Rossellini. Admission is only $7.50. Cash only, please.